Grandpa, hey, real hey, fine. Hey. We want to thank the folks over at Hee Haw for letting you come by and visit oh, with us. Oh, they don't care any time on the Wilburn, so they don't care. Oh, is that all right? Nah, well, right. fine. They told me that. When did you come to the Grand Ole Opry, Grandpa? 40, 1946. 1946. Mm -hmm. You come down picking your banjo and playing your guitar and singing good country songs, and everybody knows that. But uh, you also played another little part down at the Grand Ole Opry that uh, everybody remembers, and that's the fact that you always had a little funny to tell someone to get a little laugh out of them. <laughs> well, we hope they laugh. Well, have you, <laughs> have you got a little funny for oh, us? Oh, I could tell you about an uncle of mine. Uncle? Uh, what about your uncle? Well, I got one that lives a way back, you know, and he wanted me to come to see him one time, and I said, all right, I will, and, and I started out in my automobile, and... Well, the roads just got so bad, yes, sir. I had to quit, you know. And what's right going ahead. on? What's going on? Well, don't quit. I want to hear about you. <laughs> and, uh, so I had to stop, and I, I, I got me a, a wagon and team, and I said, well, I'll just go on this way. Well, the roads got so bad, I had to, I had to take the mule out and ride the mule. Uh -huh. So I rode up to a, to a creek, and there was a... Uh, uh, grapevine hanging down, and I swung across the creek and went on up into the, his house, and there was a sign there on the door said, Gone to the Country. Oh. <laughs>